Good morning, good morning. How is everybody doing today? I am up at the butt crack of dawn. No joke. It's like six o'clock in the morning. I'm all ready to go to work and I need some coffee. These are my parents' cups. What do you think of this necklace? I designed this necklace, actually. I, I learned to um, make jewelry when I was living in Colombia in the Emerald District down there. I went every Saturday and I apprenticed and it was super, super cool. And I learned how to like smelt silver and roll it out and cut it and I did everything. And so what I've learned most though, I did that for a couple of years, um, is that I don't actually like making the jewelry. I like designing the jewelry. I don't like making it. I like designing it and paying somebody else to make it. So I found this piece of black coral. Here, let me take it off and show you. I found this piece of black coral on a beach in Cartagena, you know, just washed up. So let's go ahead and just jump on into the budget. So not too much going on in May, just standard, you know, everyday things. A couple of holidays in there, but nothing too extraordinary. Our cell phone plan is 188.73, same as it is every month, give or take a few cents. And this storage unit, the dreaded storage unit, is $355. I have slated on this month to take you out there. Hopefully I'll be able to get out there. May is sometimes rainy, so hopefully I'll be able to find a nice weekend. We can drive all the way out there because it is about an hour and a half from where I live because it's just cheaper out there. $65 for car wash service for when Mauricio Ubers. Now, normally um, he's not Ubering right now, so we would have taken that out of the budget, but I left it in because he canceled it last month. They may or may not actually cancel it. I've, I've noticed historically that when we cancel the car wash service, it usually takes a month or two to act, uh, of you know going back and reminding them to cancel it to actually cancel. So I have it in there just in case. I don't think we're going to have to pay it. My standard $400 for gas, $50 for the monthly oil change that my husband's car needs, and $70 for the Easy Pass. Molina school tuition, the same as it is every month, $14.79. So one more month of school tuition for Molina and then yay. we're yay, then we're into summer camp and then we're into public school. So in the stores category for right now, we only have hundred dollars in Amazon and forty dollars for dry cleaning. And that could change frequently we end up pulling money from other locations to cover stuff in the stores category and that's okay insurance and tax we have our car and our runner's insurance which covers all our stuff that's out in storage and both of mauricio and i's cars and that is 159.73 we have one life insurance policy on our debts and our stuff that we can't get out of because I stupidly signed for it, which is $12 a month. But hey, if we die, then all of our debts through um, our one bank, they are wiped clean. So 9165 is my life insurance policy and Mauricio's life insurance policy is 3583. And some of the things in the giving category are Mother's Day. So we have Mother's Day for me and Mother's Day for my mother, and Mother's Day for Mauricio's mother. So for me, so Mauricio can give me a gift, and Melina can give me a gift. I have $100 total. Then Mother's Day for my mother is $50, and Mother's Day for Mauricio's mother is $50. Also in May is Teacher Appreciation Week, and I put $50 in the budget for that. I am actually a member of Melina's school parent committee meeting, committee, and they are, it's a teeny tiny group of people. I don't, I don't understand why no parents participate in this group, but um, the school is actually, what we do is we compile money from all the parents and we give gifts to um, the teachers every day for the whole week. And so I'm gonna be involved in making those and getting them ready and oh, when am I gonna come up with the time? But that is $50 that I'm putting towards that. In our miscellaneous category, $30 for iTunes for the few things like Netflix and stuff that we have drafted out of iTunes. Weight Watchers is $44.95. Blow Money, we have $200 for the month. 
uh, $25 for Mauricio's haircut. One of these days I'm going to have to get a haircut because I haven't had a haircut and I can't even tell you how long. I don't have to cut Melina's hair because Melina, Melina's Winka and Wiki, her grandparents, my parents, actually take her to get her hair cut where um, they go. For debt this month, we have $4,811.60 going to debt this month. Whoa. Yeah, that's a lot. In our cushion category, I have my standard $100 cushion in the budget, which we seem to go through pretty much every month lately. <laughs> In my YouTube category, I have $4.50 in for TubeBuddy, $4.99 for PicMonkey, and $5 for Backblaze. And all of those are tax deductible. In our medical category, we have four bills, well, three bills and a copay that are coming up in May. From back in March when Melina was sick, we have a bill still from the doctor for $29.11. We have an outstanding dentist bill from February. I'm very confused about this bill. And before I pay it, I'm actually going to call it because we we were supposed to have already covered it. So it was $125. i am not sure what it is. We have an outstanding neurology bill for my neck injections, which is $44.65. And then this month I have my my neck injections again, so I might co-pay for that is $30. And there are huge out of pocket expenses associated with my neck injections, but they usually come a couple of months after because they bill my insurance and then bill me afterwards. And the reason my neurology bill for this month is from February is so low is actually because I had to pay my deductible and this is what over what my deductible cost. So way more expensive. In our sinking funds, we have $325 going to our standard sinking funds, medical, car repair, replace, Christmas, the emergency trip to Columbia, and the miscellaneous expenses for this one. And that is our May budget. Uploading a video to YouTube, pretty big one too. Melina, did I wake you up? I am sorry. You wanna come say hi to the folks? Melina just got up, so she's feeling a little tired, so here. She's not normally up at this time of the morning. I have a feeling my talking woke her up. She's a super de duper light sleeper, and so she, I probably woke her up. So let's get her covered up. You can just lay here and take a little nappy while I film. What do you tell them, Mills? Beat ya, and make sure you subscribe and give a thumbs up. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. I love you. I didn't.